In other news, more than 13 days since the Ambimbo gold mine tragedy, families of the victims are leading contrasting lives. One family is still camping at the collapsed gold mine. Another is making burial arrangements for their kin who died in the tragedy, while another is celebrating a miracle. Take a look. <laughs> Twenty kilometers from the collapsed mine, residents of Malela village in West Uyoma have converged for a thanksgiving ceremony, complete with a feast to celebrate the miracle that saw Jack Onyango survive the six-day ordeal. A bull has been slaughtered as villagers and friends join Onyango in thanking God and also pray for his colleague Tomo Kwach, who is yet to be traced by the rescuers. Na sasa tunataka kushukuru kila mtu ambaye aliweza kufanya hii siku ikakuwa kwa sababu Jack alikuwa pale siku sita na baadaye tulikuja tukaungana na yeye. Hiyo yote inachukua mkono ya Mungu kwa sababu kama si we, sisi wenyewe hatungeweza kufanya chochote. Jack Nyango's mother says the miners should not be blamed for the tragedy because they were simply trying to earn a living. Bila kuna kazi ndio watoto wanahangaika pande hii na pande hii. Na sisi wasasi hatuna furaha. Jack Onyango is thankful to God and all those who participated in his rescue. Kwanza na ngasukuru Mungu kwa kufanya vile nilifanya. I was among the people that got accident at Abimbo. But as Onyango's family beam with joy back at the Abimbo gold mine, it is all gloom. The family of Tomo Kwach prepares to spend yet another cold night hoping that the rescuers will come out with good news. Okwach is the only one still trapped in the mine. Although, na wezaona kazi naendalea pole pole, si kubaya, lakini hapo penye kijana haku, si mzuri. Tom's elder brother Stephen Aliwa says though the long wait was taking toll on the family, they are thankful to everyone involved in the rescue mission. Kifanya haraka hata tukienda speedi hata tunaweza poteza watu wengine. Ni risk. Sasa lazima tuende pole pole. Ndio maana tuliomba support serikali watusaidie. Mtoto yangu bado yuko chini. Naomba serikali anisaidie kutafuta hiyo mtoto yuko chini. Tafadhali the family says they will continue camping at the site until their son is found.